What's up guys, this is Save Knight and welcome to another Let's Play series. Today's game is brought to you by Big Fish Games and Blue Tea Games. And by Epics, creating worlds. Best experience, please play with sound. Already am. Uh, Epics Entertainment presents. And welcome to Dark Parables, Queen of Sands, Collector's Edition. Oof, those look horrible. I've been imprisoned for years, trapped in a nightmare, shackled by one man's greed. But now, I'll have my revenge. Welcome everyone to Dark Parables, the Queen of Sands, Collector's Edition, uh, the ninth installment to the Dark Parable Saga. Um, starting from number eight, they actually got taken over by Epics, even though it still said Blue Tea Games and Big Fish Games. Um, Epics Entertainment took over the, I guess, production of these, so they changed around some of the layouts for things. One, like starting from eight, they added an achievement section. Now seven did have achievements, but they weren't listed the way they are here, and that they didn't really tell you how to get them until you've already gotten it, and then they told you you just picked up an achievement. And so from here, they actually have you know. An official list of like how to get each achievement and whatnot. Some of these are multiple levels, like finishing hops, you know, hidden object puzzles without hints within a certain amount of time, or completing a, a puzzle within a certain amount of time, or you know, watching the credits, picking up things and whatnot. And starting from number eight, um, they had um, collectibles in the game, but they were more along the lines of um, a certain object you had to pick up on every screen. So each screen had one. And when there was like 30, 40 screens to actually go through for the game, you need to remember which ones you picked up where. But other than that, I think I'm trying to remember if you beat the game and you miss some, if you can go back through the achievements list and get them again, I don't remember. I'm probably not going to bother with any of these games in here. That's some freaky eyes on that chick. Unless someone recommends I try one out. Otherwise, I'm not going to bother with it. There... I don't know what that was. Like, glitched out for a second. But yeah, so I'm not going to really bother with any of these. Well, obviously, except for the Dark Parable ones, which I've done already. Alright. Options, that's fine. 
is go ahead and start. And they also renamed the uh, the modes from casual, normal, hard, or from like easy, normal, hard, or whatever the hell it was called, the casual, hard, insane, in which I don't find hard mode to be actually that hard, so. You can change the difficulty mode during the game by selecting the menu button in the lower left corner. So people turn into these weird, like, zombie things. One week later, town of Montefleur, Provence, region, France. Detective, two days ago, we received strange reports of unexplainable phenomena occurring in the town of Montefleur. Several people witnessed a beast of incredible strength roaming the town and the surrounding forest. Others mentioned shadowy creatures appearing from a mist. Yesterday, we lost all contact with Montefleur. Your mission is to investigate the strange events in Montefleur and put a stop to them. The Red Riding Hood sisters are also there. Their help would be invaluable to your investigation. And what a surprise, I lost another horse. Shot in the face. I know you. Detective, long time no see. I'm glad you're here. It's Ruth. She's the leader of the Red Riding Hood Sisters. My wound isn't deep. A few leaves from a healing flower would help. Can you find some? Here. Use my knife to gather them. Ruth's knife. Wait here, Ruth. I'll find you one. Chapter 1. Imagine a crest for Montefleur belongs here. Okay, I don't have that. I don't have anything for that. Crossed swords, how very heraldic. Or heraldic, I'm not sure. Branch. This is the flower Ruth needs. The stem is too thick to break by hand, though. Healing flower. That stag crest is that what I wanted to do? Montefleur perfumes, biggest fragrance producer, over 100 different scents. We create perfumes designed especially for you. Come and smell your dream. I've heard rumors about Montefleur's wondrous perfumes, but they're very expensive. Healing flower. Healing herbs. There, so that should dull the pain. Thanks, Detective. The Red Riding Hood sisters are investigating that beast. But it's only been a disaster so far. <clears throat> We're staying in a cottage nearby. Follow me. A beast? I need to talk to Ruth and compare notes. It sounds like they've had a rough time. Click. Herald of Montefleur. Okay, so I think that's the thing I was talking about. Herald of Montefleur, so collect all hidden fleur de lis symbols. So on every screen, there's going to be one of these hidden somewhere. And it says one out of 39, so there's 39 rooms or areas to go to. Erected in honor of Baron Hubert de Montefleur founder of Montefleur. Hubert de Montefleur's legendary perfumes revolutionized the industry. The Baron used, used his riches to construct this beautiful city, which has since become a center for culture and fashion. His spirit lives on through his son, Eric de Montefleur. Okay, so that's not very old. Montefleur was made world famous by Hubert de Montefleur's perfumes. Everyone knows about them. 
unlock inventory. Oh. Huh? Okay, so it keeps it like up, okay. Lavender fields. no ordinary wolf. It's being manipulated by dark magic. You could think. You can't fight him head on. I mean, maybe I can make him back off. Mailbox is missing some kind of decoration on the front. I don't have anything for that. That beast threw Ruthens at the cottage. Got to make sure she's alright. Click. Beat it with a stick. Oh, okay, you do beat it with a stick. You jump back from that fire. I think I have an idea. What is this? Montefleur Crest. Part of the ring is missing. Wonder if a giant statue is buried under this land. Can't get close to him, he might leap at me. No idea what that was. I think starting from this one, or at least starting from 8, when Epics took over, you only have three actual things to pick up for each parable compared to four. From what I stunder and... Oh, I can make a torch out of this, but I need an oiled cloth. Okay, I don't have any of that with me. Back to... Montefleur Gates. Okay, that thing I think goes here. Yeah, Montefleur Crest. Complete the mural by swapping the fan parts. You may select any two parts to swap them. Okay, so that lines up. Ready? Quick mind. Solve a minigame in 30 seconds. Damn. Achievement. Puzzler. Solve a minigame without skipping. Are you the detective? I've been waiting for you. Let's talk. <gasps> go. Hope she's alright. Already, there's the end of chapter one. I'll come back, I'll start chapter two in the wherever that's at. The main street. And look for that lady I was trying to talk to before someone threw a freaking cart at her. So until then, this is Save Knight on Let's Play Dark Parables Queen of Sands Collector's Edition. Later, guys.